jump straight to third. Dial now has got a lot of speed, but he's going to have to work really hard to get past Hancock. Here comes Dial on the inside. Jason Dial on the inside run has just passed Greg Hancock. His second, Everson now tries to run on Hancock, but Jason Dial, what a ride from him. He has never won a Grand Prix. Looking really good for Dial. Hancock made such a good start initially. Dial didn't quite get that, but Dial's got a lot of pace in that bike. Hancock now switching to the inside. It isn't over yet. Dial's looking good. Lifting down the back straight, generating more and more spring. Oh, he's got some speed through that bottom corner. There's a lot to go. Hancock, can he respond? Dial, can he win his first Grand Prix? He's looking good for it. Jason Dial has never won a Grand Prix in his career. He's on the verge of a momentous moment. Jason Dial! Smarslick's going to try the outside run. Doyle has the lead. Wolfenden second. Here comes Smarslick. Oh, there's no way through. Wolfenden pushing hard. Jason Doyle hard. Doyle's got the lead. Wolfenden tries the inside run. Oh! Ty Wolfenden has the lead. Smarslick is it. Doyle's coming back for more. Wolfenden holds the lead. Now Doyle. Jason Doyle. What a move from Doyle. Now he claps it down on the curve. Smarslick's there as well. Wolfenden trapped on the inside. Oh, you can throw a black out. Set up, what a move, they've gone back to the winning set up and they're winning the final. Hancock back in third, that's ideal for Doyle. Doyle will close in the championship chase with Everson out the back. So Jason Doyle going on to win his third Grand Prix of the season, what a rider. Can you believe it? Jason Doyle, the man of the moment, four wins earlier and now he is going to win the German Grand Prix. Jason Doyle does it again. Smarslick second and third place went to the line with Everson and Hancock. That was simply stunning. Can Doyle make it? Three Whoa. wins off the bounce. He's made the start. He's got that first turn. Now can he defend his lead? Jason Doyle down the back straight. Holder's coming through. Great ride from Chris Holder. Jason Doyle just needs to be sensible now. Ride a decent line and Lindgren's charging hard as well. Lindgren's come past Zagar. Holder is in second, but Jason Doyle is in the lead and he's on the verge of a third straight Grand Prix victory. Fabulous riding once again from Jason Doyle. I thought he may have just jumped the start, but no red light came on. And he's out in front, he's riding brilliantly once again. Holder like the semi-final. From the outside, he's battled his way through in the second place. It's an Aussie one so fantastic for them. Lingwood looks like he's gonna get on the rush from Zago will miss out. But what can you say? Doyle, three on the spin, what a rider. First time in a decade since a rider has won three GPs on the trot. Jason Doyle has done it! Jason Doyle is winner of the Stockholm Speedway Grand Prix in the French Arena. Dudek has made a good start, so has Hancock. What about that from Doyle off gate four? Jason Doyle, a stunning move from the Australian. You said it, Kelvin, to be fair. You called it in the build-up to the race. If he makes the start, he could sweep across and have the advantage. Doyle has the lead. Hancock is second. Millick is third. Putting pressure on. Here comes Hancock now. Hancock tried the dive up the inside, but Doyle's got the
the speed and the line. What a start from the outside from Jason Dorn. He's had to work so hard. He won in fine style here last year, getting the better of Hancock. Can Hancock now repay the compliment? It's tight. All three tied out in front. Minix there. Dunex out the back. Dorn, what a stunning move that was from the outside to get to the front. We're just over a lap to go. Dorn out in front. The world champion in second place. Yeah, stunning stuff from Jason Doyle, who is going to win a Grand Prix here in Prague yet again, just like he did last year. It is a spectacular effort here from Jason Doyle here in the Marquetta Stadium. Hancock oh! takes second place, Milik is third, and that was a sensational speedway race again and a stunning speedway meeting. Side gate. Now Doyle is going to try the big run around the outside. Jason Doyle can't quite get there. Dunek and Doyle, the top two in the world, wheel to wheel. Dunek holding on superbly. And now Wofferden is catching up. Smarslinks in there as well. Oh, oh how close can he again? Oh, he can't get any closer and st not stay on. Fabulous opening lap of speedway from Dunek. Doyle coming on strong again in second place. Wofferden through the first Here goal. He goes. Jason Doyle! Dunek's packed up! Unbelievable here! What a speedway race! Oh. Here in Melbourne, it's the last lap of the year! Happy Christmas, everyone! Happy New Year! And it's a happy 2017 for Jason Doyle! Winner of the 2017 QBE Insurance Australian FIM Speedway Grand Prix in the Etihad, and he is the new champion of the world!